Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today's video is about step and repeat function. I've done a several videos of this, but I've never done one on spacing between the object. So we have our object here. It's a name tag that's three inches. The only way I used to do it would be to make my nudge distance 3.5 and make a duplicate, and that puts it a half inch apart. And that's really a good way, too. But then you have to go back and change it. It's always good to learn this. So go up to edit, step and repeat, and we're going to have no vertical offset. And you have three options, no offset, offset, or space between objects. And you can actually tell it which way to go. We're going to tell it to go the right a half inch. Now, it's going to make six copies. And if you only want six copies because you've already got one, hit apply. And it made five copies plus your original six. Now we can group all these or select all these, go on no offset this time, and space between objects. And right here, you can go up or down. You don't have to worry about negative numbers. We want to go down five copies and hit a 0.5 down. And it put everything a half an inch apart throughout the sheet if you were making a bunch of name tags or anything, or making a template to put name tags into. This would make a really good way to make a template on a piece of MDF to place name tags down into to further engrave on them. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.